Hey everyone and welcome back to the channel. My name is Emmanuel Dijon and I teach beginners just like you how to start a career in DevOps. In today's video, I will discuss Linux distributions and the seven best types of Linux distributions that exist. If you've ever heard of Linux, you may know it's an operating system similar to Windows or Mac OS, but with a difference. Instead of just one version, there are many different versions of Linux called distributions or distros for short. Each one has its own unique style and features. And I guess you're asking yourself, Emmanuel, why are there so many versions of Linux? Simple. Each distribution is built with different users in mind. Whether you are new to Linux or an experienced tech user, there is a Linux distribution for you. In this video, I will explain what a Linux distribution is, the seven best types of Linux distributions, and who each one is best for. By the end, you will know which one may be right for you. So without taking much of your time, let's get started. What exactly is a Linux distribution? In simple terms, a Linux distribution or a distro is a customizable operating system or another type of operating system that's built on top of the Linux kernel and includes a package management system and other software. Now, I guess you're asking yourself, Barry Manuel, what is a kernel? The Linux kernel is the core of the Linux operating system and act as an interface between a computer's hardware and software. So how do developers use it to create another operating system? Developers start by extracting the Linux kernel from Linux. From there, developers add essential system software, a user-friendly interface, in the case of Linux, a CLI, and basic applications to make it easy for people to use. This process forms an entirely new operating system called a distribution. Each distribution uses a different customization style to meet the needs of different users. For example, the Ubuntu distribution fan base differs from that of Red Hat or CentOS. Now, let's look at the seven best Linux distributions, each with its own strengths and ideal users. I will keep it simple so you can quickly get a feel for each one. At number one position, we have Ubuntu. Ubuntu is among the most popular Linux distributions, especially for beginners. Ubuntu is very user-friendly and has tons of helpful guidelines online. If you're new to Linux, it's a great place to start. At the second position, we have Linux Mint. Linux Mint is perfect for people switching from Windows. It has a similar look and feel, making it easier to adjust. Plus, it is stable and easy to use. So if you're someone who is switching from Windows to Linux and still want to have that feel of Windows, Linux means is for you. At the third position, we have Fedora. Fedora is popular among developers and tech people. It comes with the latest software and tools, making it an excellent choice for cutting edge technology. At fourth position, we have Debian. Debian is known for being extremely stable and reliable. It is widely used for servers and by advanced users who need something they can depend on. At the fifth position, we have Arch Linux. Arch is highly customizable, perfect for power users who like complete control over their systems. If you're looking for something extremely customizable, Arch is the best choice for you. For number six, we have the one and only Kali Linux. Kali is designed specifically for cybersecurity and penetration testing. If you're interested in cybersecurity, Kali has all the tools you will need to get started. So if you're someone who's thinking of getting into cybersecurity and needs to start learning Linux, starting with Kali Linux is a great choice. At number seven position, we have CentOS Strength. Before I dive in and I start talking about CentOS, 
I want you to know that CentOS is simply a free alternative to Red Hat. CentOS is great for enterprise or business environment. It is stable and reliable, which makes it a good choice for professional use. So guys, these are some of the best Linux distribution, each made with different users in mind. There is something for everyone. If you're interested in trying Linux, go ahead and pick a distribution that sounds right for you. Whether you are new to Linux or experienced in tech, there is a Linux distribution that would definitely fit your need. Let me know in the comment which distro or distribution you plan to try or you're already trying. And don't forget to please like, subscribe and share this video. In my next video, I will talk about how to set up a Linux lab environment. See you in my next video. Bye.